Hello, you wonderful people. Welcome back to The Quarry. Welcome to part three. Man, it has been kicking off. Mate, there's been a lot of stuff happening. I'll try and update you as we go along, but if you've watched part two, then you'll know what's happening. Wow, this game is really, really, really good. <laughs> Worth the wait. Um, like I said, I made a maybe an unpopular, just, uh, unpopular opinion, is that I actually believe that um, this is actually better than Until Dawn. And that may be a controversial opinion. But it is absolutely amazing and I'm loving every second. Wait, what's going on with the sound? The next few weeks were long. It's better. The cop kept us fed and let us take showers, but aside from that, we barely saw him. Max and I, we talked a lot. As much as we could about what happened that night. It was like trading conspiracy theories. We talked about the cop, the camp, the accident, the woods, the thing in the basement. What happened to Max? We just kept going over it all again and again, and nothing was making sense. All we knew is that we needed to get out of there. Yeah, uh, Max obviously fine because there wasn't a full moon. But I think this is going to be the next month, so this is going to be the full moon. I can't take this anymore. It's not that bad. They're probably in the same crap at camp. No, I can't take being in here anymore. Oh. Yeah, well, that part's pretty tough. It's gonna be a full moon. We've gotta do something. We've gotta get out of here. We need a, a plan. We well, keep saying that, but it's been weeks, so, you know, let me know if you have one. That's really not very helpful, Max. You are forgetting something. What? Just the ETBT. Tiny detail that I may or may not be a fucking werewolf, you Laura. Keep it down. So what? What can we do, really? We run off into the sunset only to be stopped when I turn into a nasty ass monster and kill you and eat you, and then I run off alone into the sunset with little bits of you stuck in my teeth? Okay, okay, stop. Just one problem at a time. All right, we, we don't even know if that's what's really going on, and we won't until we get the hell out of here. Okay. Well, it seems to me that we only have two real options. We can play nice and try to get this guy on our side. What, so he'll let us go? Or... We try to catch him off guard and make our escape. Go on his good side, I reckon. Okay, so... Let's say we get on his good side. What then? Brunch in mimosas every Sunday till he sees the error of his ways? Yeah, I was being rhetorical. The dude doesn't have a good side to get on. I mean, he don't even talk to us half the time. I don't know, I think we could crack him. Laura, I think he's just biding his time until he can figure out a way to get rid of us. Permanently. Now he's waiting to see if you turn, Max. I think we should try. I mean, if he was gonna kill us, we'd be dead by now. He's waiting till the so full moon. So what's he waiting for? The full moon. Look, we just... If this doesn't work, we try to escape. Deal? Yeah. Deal. So, all right, how are we supposed to get this guy to like us if he won't even talk to us? I don't know. I mean, he's got to have a weak spot, like something we can use. It's not like we don't have time to figure it out. Yeah. Okay. Hey, hey, T-Money. Can I call you T-Money? Why? T-Money. You can call me Officer Hackett. Hackett? Like as in Hackett's quarry? What's it to you? Just interested is all. Feel like we hardly know you. Well, let's keep it that way. Okay. Oh, come on, T Money. Lighten up, man. No reason we can't be buds, right? I can think of seven. You're right. We've been just awful, and we really want to make it up to you. Oh. Oh. I see what you're doing. What's well, not going to work? 
You think we're just gonna be besties, and I'm gonna let you walk right out of here. Not gonna happen. Asshole! Max! Max, you know got what's big going mouth. on? We know Max is a werewolf! Oh, shoot. Full moon's in a few days, right? What, what then? No, ma'am. You don't know the half of it. I said, take your fucking clothes off. Fuck off! Get back! Max, what's going on? <laughs> Get the fuck away oh, from right. him! It's the day they brought him in. Nate, he doesn't look healthy at all. Come here. Shut up. Have a seat. Oh my gosh. Ah! Quit squirming. Said you want to be a vet, right? Call us an internship. Let me go! You're not going to believe it until you see it for yourself. Oh, is it? All oh, right, yeah. Ask next time, then, dude. I know what's happening. Jeez. Don't get too close. The hunters. Mm-hmm. Just wrapping things up here. Down to 20. Over. What's gonna happen? Well, I'll tell you. It's not gonna be pretty. But don't worry. I'll be back at dawn. You're really gonna leave me here? You'll be fine. Just don't get too close. It's morphin' time! Oh, bro. Max, tell me exactly what you're feeling. Laura, I... I don't feel so good. Not good like how? I don't know, just... bad. Come closer, let me see your eyes. Don't I think I better stay back. Max, I need to observe you. Is this fucking close enough for you, bitch? It's like they regenerate, isn't it? He got her eye! That's how she lost her eye. Wait, does that mean she's a werewolf too? Or did he just take her eye clean out? I know, because she got scratched and she's got a scar. Yeah, so she's infected too. Wait, no, she can't be because she didn't turn. Let's 
see what that bastard cop's hiding. I want to go and see. in this cell? Nothing. I mean, I wonder what's in that, you know that hole that she dug in her cell? I wonder what that is. That's the... Uh, what is the cave the wolves hunt their prey? Hmm, yes. No, I can continue looking. I'm not going to go to sleep. I want to see what was in that hole in the wall. She didn't really show us, you know? Wait, is there anything in there? Oh, I guess not. Oh, shoot, mate. Honestly, the thing is been freaky. Wait, is that blood? Is that Max's blood? It's a terrifying sound. I'll say that. All right, let's go and see what um, Mr. Hackett is saying. Hiding. Oh yeah, that's her blood, isn't it? Of course. A bit slow on the old uptake today, Azza. Alright, cool. So she she sewed up her own eye, which is pretty cool. Like a true veterinarian. Uh no, don't go through there yet. I wanna look uh, look around a bit more. So this this police station is completely deserted. No. There's what happened here? Like everyone in this place just dead. Locked. Figures. And I guess I can't leave Max. Better keep snooping, or I could go back to my cell and wait, I guess. Uh no, you need to go and see what that cop's hide in. To get in his office. What's he hiding? I need to get in there. Okay. Right this way. Okay, there's an upstairs. So we'll have a look upstairs. Uh, up there. Probably where his uh, his the main part of the police station is. <sighs> Fuck! I'm gonna need to rest soon. Here we go. What we got? What we got? Anything juicy? What's this? Happy birthday, son. Huh. Mama's boy. 56 now, oh, Tom Girl, you're a good boy, Travis. 56. That means he was born in 1965. 1965. Mate, this place is a dump. Is he even a real cop? I don't know whether he is, you know. Unless these werewolves have just, whatever these things are, have just completely ravaged the entire place. Get in there, no. Oh, hang on, I can. Here we go. Is this his office? No, this isn't. Sheriff's badge. Whoever was wearing this can't be doing too well. 
charge sheriff's badge. This old sheriff's badge is badly fire damaged. Does it belong to the current sheriff or one of his predecessors? Very interesting. I'm going to become a detective myself. And I'm going to put two and two together. Wait, is there something here? I can use the pencil to... No? Okay. Anything interesting? Anything else interesting, even? No, I think that's it for this room. One more room. Ah. This must be what he used to knock me out. Syringe. I can hide this in my cell. Good plan. Need to lie down. Yeah, you do, but you need to go, you've got stuff to find first, mate. You need information. But well, what on earth is going on? What's this? Calendar. Full moon. What's the other date? Birthday beers. July 7th. That's my anniversary, that is. Sorry, me and my wife's wedding anniversary. Birthday beers. Oh, I guess let's go back downstairs. I mean, he's not coming back anytime soon because he's, you know, otherwise engaged until dawn. Till dawn? All right, let's go back to the cell. We've got a syringe. Gosh, Max. You're not in a good way, you son. Okay, we need to go back. Oh, shoot, mate. It sounds like he's really close. I guess because he is. Uh, let's hide it here. Oh, that's pretty much everything, I think. Let's go to sleep. Wait, did he shut that cell door? I left the cell door open, that's a bit risky. You want to tell me what happened? I could ask you the same thing. Been blooded. Why didn't you run? We've got unfinished business. Like what? Like how you're gonna tell me exactly just what the fuck is really going on here. Why would I do that? Because I could be halfway home by now. But I'm not. Because I have to help Max. Maybe I can help you, too. Turn around, hands against the wall. Seriously? I am too tired to argue. But... Ugh. Me, too. Happy? Brew some coffee. What's this? An education. Watch.
Is it like cell footage of him turning into that werewolf? It's the day after, isn't it? Nice job cleaning up. The eye. I mean. It's harder than they make out in the textbooks. Especially when nobody's helping you. You're the doctor. Uh, animal doctor. And no, I'm not. And I probably never will be. Stuck in here forever. You know, just because you know, doesn't mean you know. You know? Yeah. Uh, no. What? I'm not. This isn't what it seems to be. Yeah, that's what the, the woman said, Grace. You're going to have to be more specific. You and Max are in just as much trouble as I am. My family? We didn't mean to hurt anybody. We're just trying to survive like everybody else. Do you understand? Not really. We're going to end this thing once and for all. We? Yeah. So, how is your family involved? My family... ...is down at the bottom of a well. What? Family is the most important thing in the world. But if your whole family, you know, like every last one of them decided to jump down the bottom of a well and they're all just hanging on the end of a rope, how can one person be expected to pull them all back out? You can't. If so you pull on that rope and you're just going to fall right down to the bottom of the well with the rest of them. And what's the point of that? Just a metaphor. Right, so you... You're the one at the top of the well with a rope, and... Yes. I thought that was obvious. <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah, I got it. <laughs> Just forget it. Come on, Travis, you're starting to ease up, bruv. We're having a good chat, yeah? Heart to heart. Let's see how smart you really are. What do you mean? What is this? Information. Well, what does it mean? Read it. When full the moon above shines first, the beast internal shall outward burst. One by one leads lambs to slaughter. It stalks your breath, but shuns clear water. And should you yourself be cursed, armed with silver and the first, when moon is full before its wane, rend the beast that cursed you slain. No longer shall you face your blight or fear the dread of full moon's light. Yeah. Keep reading. Stupid decision. I'm not gonna do it. And if it's a bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. Perchance you'll save your cursed soul before infection takes its toll. Starting to get the picture. It's not a lot to go on. I know what it means. Me, and sir. Frankly, it's shit. Why did they have to make it rhyme? I don't know. 
but it's all we have to go on. Oh, it's the traveling circus. Put a curse Kill on them. the werewolf that bit you, and you'll be cured. It has to be silver. It has to be full moon. Silas was the one in the cage. Seems pretty straightforward to me. If you can kill the werewolf, and that's a big if. I just want to cure Max. Can you cure them? It's not as straightforward as you think. So wait, if Max got me in the eye, doesn't that mean I'm infected now too? No. Scratches don't do it. Only bites. Are you sure about that? Pretty sure. So what's the plan? Well, that's where I'm hoping you'll come in. Me? Yeah. Because your studies. I haven't even started. Well, you're the best option I got. I've been hunting this damn white wolf under the full moon so long I start to think it doesn't exist, you know? Maybe it doesn't matter, because maybe there's another way. Is it like an alpha? Whatever you believe, there's got to be some science. And you do science. Look, take some time to think about all this. I'll be back in the morning. Seen enough? I don't think I'd believe a word he just said if I hadn't... If I hadn't seen that. I believe him. You can't tell me you really trust that guy now. I didn't say that. I said I believe him about the werewolf stuff, not the science bit. I don't know what he wants. He's a dirty, lying, kidnapping cop, Laura. We should be careful of anything that fucker says. Well, fuck him. He's had his chance to fix this. We're getting out of here and we're gonna fix it on our own. Hey, Laura? Yeah? I saw what happened. What I did to your eye? Yeah. Is it bad? It's gone, mate. Yeah, it's pretty bad. I'm so sorry. It wasn't you. I know it wasn't you. I know. But it was. We're gonna fix you, Max. I promise. I promise. You said let me in there. Chris! I know they're in there. Who? The counselor. Show up. How'd you find out? Bobby told me. He said you scrapped an abandoned car. A while back, I, I worked out the rest. Shit. Why? Why'd you think, Chris? Jesus, Travis. You're still here, that's fucked up. I fucking bit one of them, Chris. What's I supposed to do? You bit one of them. Oh, gosh. He bit them. 
He bit Max. Chris was the one. You shot me. I'm telling Mom. I think your lucky stars wasn't silver. What's your plan? You can't keep him here forever. I'm handling it. Maybe if you'd done your job, they wouldn't have been at the camp that night. You ever think of that? If I'd have done my job, you'd all be in prison. You ever think of that? That was all Bobby and Caleb. Are those know. hikers? And that, that, that fucking journalist? Damn it, Travis. What are we going to do now? Whatever happened to you, we're all in this together. Shit, man. Let's go to my office. We shouldn't talk here. Max! Uh. Max! Uh. What is it? Travis was just in the hall talking, the cop. So? With Chris Hackett. Was he here to let us out? No. He's the werewolf, Max. Chris Hackett is the one that bit you down on the storm shelter. Holy shit, that's... Who would have guessed? I didn't, to be I mean, fair. I guess, thinking about it, I could have... And yet you didn't. It all makes sense. That's why Chris's car was at the lodge that night. Travis was protecting him. That's why he followed us, and that's why he didn't kill the werewolf in the storm shelter, because it was his fucking brother. God, it's so obvious. If, if Chris was the one that bit me, then... Yeah, then that's our cure. That's how we fix you. Jesus, Laura, are we thinking the same thing? Are we, like, connected? Tomorrow, we're getting out of here. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna get Travis's gun. And kill Chris Hackett. Not Chris Hackett, mate. Hey! Hey! Help her! Laura needs help! Uh, Laura! Uh, Laura, are you okay? God damn it. You sure it's damn infected? What the hell's going on? Laura! <gasps> Fuck. I think he was trying to lead these. He said, lead the lambs to slaughter. <laughs> Starting to think you were really sick. Well, maybe I should consider acting as my major. <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> we should go before he wakes yeah. up. Bro, he's out for the count. Should we go to his office? We should grab our staff. We need silver ammo. He must have some around here. In his office. What is it? I thought I heard someone. Something was here. No, I, I still can't. It's coming from behind that door. I'm ready. Was it like a bed? The shotgun shells and a shotgun. There's nobody in here. What the fuck? 
He makes them. What is it? Shotgun shells. He loads them with silver. That's where he was last month, hunting. Well, I guess I won't be needing this anymore. Hey, I just realized something. We're free. No, Max. We're not free until Chris Hackett is dead. And it doesn't look like we've got much time. I know, you're right, but... Let's just take the win for now, huh? We'll celebrate when it's over. We're going straight to Hackett's quarry, and we're ending this. Tonight. Interesting. And I made my way here, to camp. Left, left Max at the island, seemed like the best place for him, surrounded by water and all. That's it. That's the story. Don't all jump in at the same time. Was Max the one that Wait. attacked um, Emma? The island? Like like our island? Like the one in the lake? Yeah, why? Because Jacob, he went back there looking for Emma and he hasn't come back yet. Neither of them has. Oh, shit. Well, as long as they didn't go poking around where they shouldn't have, they're probably fine. Poking around where he shouldn't have is Jacob's middle name. This is very bad. Oh. After you saw me at the pool, after I shot Chris, um, I went back to the island expecting Max to be back to normal. But... But he wasn't. She goes have a badass eye patch. Hello? Max is back.
crazy. Crazy. So the werewolf I killed can't have been Chris. That wasn't a werewolf. It was Kay Kaylee Hackett, Chris's daughter. Ka Kaylee Whatever Hackett. Whatever I shot, that was no girl. Unless, I, I guess, it turned back after I shot it when I went to the island. Wait, so how come Max didn't kill you then? He tried. I got away. I need to end this. We don't have much time. An animal. God, let me go! Let me fucking go! Get your hands off me! <clears throat> please let me go! Okay, I didn't mean for this to happen, please! Please! Oh my god, why aren't you answering me? Is your, is your money that you want? Cause, cause my dad's got money. Like lots of it. How are you? I mean, not really, but you could get some, probably. Please, <laughs> just let me go, please. I'm so sorry. Oh, Jesus Christ! Ah, he's strong. That's too, Bobby. Hey! Hey! Hey, where are you going? Hey! Hey! Oh, yeah. Stay outside, mate. To be by myself. By myself. Careful what you want. Yeah, I found one. It's always nice to see you. Isn't it fun delving into the past? They're a bad lot, aren't they? Shall we have a look at what you found? You them, um. Chariot. The chariot. At the reins of a chariot, we would all feel safer. Taking control, relying on determination to make our choices. Valiant, but in some cases foolish. Many seek refuge in chariots, but perhaps in some cases they're not as safe as we think they are. And the same question as always Will you let me show you more? Go on.
You'll be seeing me a few more times before the night's over. I look forward to that. Thanks, mate. As long as you follow the right path, of course. Cheers, mate. Um, right, so... Hmm. Chariots. Some seek refuge in chariots. Sometimes we're not always safe. Yeah, very interesting. Chapter 8. So it's now quarter to one. Where is Chris Hackett? Shut up. Let's fight till dawn. What a rude. Guys, she murdered Kaylee. We have been over this. Uh, Caitlin? What do I do? Oh, wow. Real strong showing on the leadership front. I said shut up. <laughs> Oh, no way. I am not getting involved. This is all you, buddy. Look, just think about everything that's happened tonight, okay? That's all I'll say. Hold up. You, you said you heard a woman crying when you escaped? Why? What do you know? It's the ghost story he told us about, right, Caitlin? This isn't a ghost story. It's a creature feature. It's really happening, and you're all in it. Your bracelet. What are you doing? I'm trying to help. Worst case scenario, this should give you a fighting chance. And this will kill them? For good? Yeah. But what if it's Nick or someone? Like I said, worst case scenario. This is where it gets put real. Put thing down before you hurt someone. So, come on. Where does Chris Hackett live? When he's not at camp, I mean. What makes you think I know that? Uh, you guys are counselors, right? You've spent the last two months here? He's not in the storm shelter. I'm clearly getting nowhere hunting him in the woods. I need a place to start. I think that spooky house behind these woods. Dude! What? Listen, there could be another way. Have you thought about that? I've spent the last month thinking about nothing else. Look, when the sun comes up, I am stuck until the next full moon. So is Max, so is anyone else he's bitten. How is that our problem? Why don't you ask your friends in the woods? And don't forget about Nick, dude. Okay, any closer one of the spray you two with cold water. Ryan, let's just get out of here. I'm running out of time. If I can't find Chris Hackett, then a lot more people are going to get hurt. I'm going with you. What? what? Uh... Yeah, what they said. There's no way I'm letting a murdering fugitive like you go anywhere near Chris on your own. Wow, are you flirting with me? What? No. Fine, do whatever you want. You saw what happened to Nick. He was bitten. Everything's gonna be fine. That cop car you stole, where is it? Ditched in the lake. Why? <gasps> it was a stolen cop car. You're gonna have to try and fix the minivan. Get somewhere safe. How long do you have? An hour or two? I don't know. It doesn't seem like an exact science. Then we better get going. Very interesting. Are you sure this is the right way? Pretty sure, yeah. 
Pretty or definitely? What do I look like, a tour guide? Have you actually been there before? I mean, n no. Wait, seriously? I know as much as you do. How well do you know Chris Hackett? Mr. H, pretty well. Like you're pretty sure we're going the right way? When I first came to camp, I was going through some personal shit, and Mr. H helped me sort it out. He's a good guy. You don't know him like I do. You don't know him at all. Okay, okay, jeez. Teacher's pet. Why are you like this? I should ask you the same thing. What do you mean? Why are you really here? I can't let you just shoot him. I'm not going to. I'm going to shoot a werewolf, which he definitely is, by is the way. Is not. Is too. It's not. Jesus. This is going to be a problem. A very big problem. There it is. Back your house. So he lives in some redneck mansion with his redneck family in the ass crack of the woods? Look at this place. No, but it's where his mom lives, I think. Never been there. But if we're looking for answers, it's probably the best place to start. So, uh, wait, how do we get there? What do you mean? How do we get to the house? That's a really good question. Maybe we just don't. Look, I understand Chris is your friend. If there was another way, I'd tell you. Sure. Yeah. Laura, Chris is a good man. This isn't about good and evil, Brian. Just how can you be so certain? If I let my conscience slow me down now, everything gets a lot worse for everyone. Believe me, if there's another way, I'm all for it. Hey, where are you going? You're on the timer, remember? There must be another way across somewhere. I got you. Careful, it's gonna go. <laughs> At least she landed in clean water. Holy shit! Are you okay? Laura? Didn't like that clear water. It stalks your breath but shuns clear water. Oh my god, Laura. Jesus, Mary and Jazz Hands. Here's a thought. What are you doing? Relax. Look. Oh. Oh, okay. What big eyes you have, Grandma? No shit. Can you see yellow in my eyes? Define yellow? Shit. We haven't got much time. Crikey! Nothing around there? I wonder if there's a tarot card anywhere. I reckon the, um... Tarot mum is mum. This must be part of the old working quarry. Sorry, I'm going to read that. Miner's lunchbox. Forgotten belongings of a quarry miner abandoned in the tunnels. A letter of foreclosure within indicates that this has been down here since the 1930s. Sense? Uh, you've always got to read it again because they don't really let you read it. Right, okay, hang on, what's this? 
Uh, dear valued employee, I regret to inform you that your services at Hackett's Quarry will no longer be required. It is my intention to return to the site of the central quarry to an area of natural beauty by flooding it and allowing a lake to perform in its place. Interesting. To be paid until the end of this coming week and then asked to vacate the premises. I'd like to thank you for your continued loyalty and wish you well in your future endeavours. Yours faithfully, Septimus Hackett. Then he wrote, type bastard can't pay us. Uh, last time I trust a Hackett. Okay, so they, they flooded the quarry and uh, turned it into a lake. Nice, nice going, mate. And then uh, made a summer camp, I guess. How nice of you all. It's cool, our eye grew back. Silas! Did you hear that too? It's her. Who? The hag of Hackett's quarry. It's like she's warning us off. The woman Not reading the tarot us. cards has got to be the hag, isn't she? She is the hag of Hackett's quarry. They can't have done. This place is not up to code. I mean, if the code is literally crumbling to the ground, then I think it's doing fine. Let's just keep moving. Yeah. Best friends now, these two. Careful. Jeez. Well, she pushed him. <laughs> It's got to lead up to the. Uh... Oh, that's deep. It's got to lead up to the uh, the quarry, isn't it? Oh look, up to the house. Sorry, not the quarry. The lovers. As harmony and disagreement brought to light only by sparks of passion, blood flows from the heart. You can almost taste it, and tasting it could save someone's life. Uh, I mean, that could be um, Jacob and Thingy. Just look at this place. Oh, Laura, Max. It seems to have really I changed. I really do with a hamburger right about now. Yeah, she's um. Stop being weird. <laughs> she's turning into like yeah. She's her attitude's completely changing. The same as um. Uh, Nick when he was complaining about how he's hungry and wants to strip um Abby's meat off the bone or whatever. A bit weird. Oh boy, this is high. Whoa. You okay there, mate? You scared of heights? Don't do it. Do you think actually... Scarred flesh, hang on. Lump of what appears to be damaged or scarred flesh. Something is in here Lovely. with us. Either that or this route isn't as disused as we thought. Chris Hackett's using this route, mate. down well where's cave out <laughs> look who's finding their funny bone so what's your deal then what do you mean the whole mysterious brooding loner thing, it doesn't quite fit with the I love my camp leader vibe. So I don't fit into the right box, is that what you're saying? 
And what box would that be? Nothing. Forget it. Do you always do that? Do what? Uh, start to engage in a conversation and then just immediately recoil into your shell. Maybe I don't want to talk to you anymore. Oh, wow. <laughs> charming. I am assuming you're single? Yeah. Why? No reason. Quality banter. This way. I see a light. Yeah. Which reminds me of the mine until dawn. Or you can just hang out here. Up to you. Someone's been eating their spinach. Or turning into a werewolf. So, you want to go into the collapsing nightmare tunnel first, or shall I? Okay. Settles that. Wait. Oh, look. Yeah, I got another one. Well, wheel. Well, <laughs> wheel of fortune. Uh, after all, fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel. Sometimes you have to take a chance. Camel works in mysterious ways, but it favours those who pay attention. Watch closely, though the wheel spins, the eagle eye can tell where it's going to stop. All right. What's your leg doing, bro? Looks promising. These miner, mining hats, are they? Wait, is there stuff here? This looks like interesting stuff, to be honest. What's over here? Anything? Oh, wait, hang on. This is telling me I can walk, is it? Alright, fine. Hmm, I think we're definitely underneath the house. What was this? Careful. Splinters. Thanks. I'm fine. I'm a werewolf. Guess we found the party. Alcohol. And prohibition. These are rum running tunnels. That would make that liquor almost a hundred years old. Probably still good. Good. Try vintage. Well, I guess the hackets were bootleggers. That makes sense. I guess when the cores are done, they branched out. Hmm. Come on, time travel later. They filled it with a lake to conceal their suspicious activities. Mm. Let's have a cheeky drink. Or not, maybe we should just go upstairs. You think this is it? Uh, beach me. I'm pretty much completely lost. <sighs> yeah, me too. Shall we? Yes, but first I need a wee. Sorry. We're back. Let's go. Kaylin. 25 to... Well, that's the first crash. So, well, I guess that's good. Kind of my bad. Had a bit of a tumble with one of the locals. The fuck, Caitlin? This place is wrecked. <laughs> well, you should see the other guy. No, nah, he's what fine. What do you think happened to Jacob and Emma? Probably nothing. Hopefully. I mean, I mean, should we go find them? Warn them? I think the safest thing, the most responsible thing, is to try and get help. Right. And then we can come back for them. And Nick. And Nick. Nick's done, mate. Wait. What? I 
Is there? Emma is in the car. In there? She hid in there, didn't she? I don't know. What is it? I... Jacob? Emma? Are they? Should I open it up? Your funeral, buddy. Wait, Emma didn't get bit. Oh, oh, she makes me! She makes me! Oh. Hey, it's us! Oh, oh shit. It burns! Oh my god. Oh. I, wait. I'm wait. so sorry. Dylan, I am so, so sorry. Oh, I didn't know it was you. I was really oh. scared and I thought. It's not Mace. What? Air freshener. Oh. It's kid, dramatic. Yeah. It's all I could find in the van. Why is she moving around so much? Why don't you look through the window? I have so many questions. Oh, but she has questions. Uh, Dylan? <laughs> You're, uh... <laughs> so she was in the police station this whole time? Insane, right? This whole time, we were having such a fun summer. We never knew. Jeez. Okay. Can you fix it? No. Oh. Not without some parts. Brand. Specifically, a rotor arm. There's a scrapyard up the road. So you can fix it? Well, no promises, but if there's hope, that's where we're gonna find it. That sounds like a long shot. Dylan, come on. Look, I need you. We need you. Fine. Okay. Once again, Dylan puts himself in mortal danger for the sake of his work friends. What exactly are we supposed to do? I mean, the van is nice, but it's not exactly Fort Knox. Well, there's a shelter under the lodge. You could be safe there for a while. All right. Abby, you're with me. Good luck. I wonder if there is a way to cure them. That is just hope, hopeful. What was that? Huh? What was that? Oh, it's nothing. We got we got guests downstairs. We don't want any more blood on our hands. On our hands. Cool, so I'm Ryan now. What's in here? Oh, hello. Yeah, I found another one. What does it say? Empress. Look at her. Look at those top... Look at the top can... Those... Why? Why can't I read simple English? Look at her. Those at the top can fall the hardest. Such a shame. To nurture little monsters. Only to live long enough to watch them kill you. But it is no less than she deserves. Talking about the mother, aren't they? Oh, well, which one? I've collected quite a few, so which one do I actually want to see? That is... That is question. That's right. Come on. Wait, I want to see something. In terms of my clues, how much evidence have I got? Too much. Only half of it. It's not very good. Charge Sheriff's badge. Oh, look, we got another clue. Previous sheriff was killed in the fire six years ago, so presumably this belonged to him. Travis must have succeeded him. Okay. Faded camp photograph. 
C Hackett and T Hackett. Chris and Travis, they're brothers. Box of matches. Laura used these matches to light a campfire and wait until nightfall to hunt Chris. This explains the light Caitlin saw on the island. Okay, great. Uh, Councillor's Ledger. Laura and Max were kidnapped by Travis and Chris tried to hide it by reporting that they didn't show up at camp. Chris had it written to note to the camp nurse, yet what happened with that? It makes total sense. No reason on a time limit. Chris didn't want to risk the nurse being around when he turned into a werewolf. Yeah, it makes sense, I guess. Excellent. Thank you for that. Thank you for waiting. Oh, what's this? Rum still. Oh, from the Prohibition. From the Prohibition days, a relic of the Packets family past. Interesting. I like this clue system. It's this is cool. an old still. I guess business was booming. Business was booming. Wait, was there anything down there? Because I did. Oh, here we are. What's this? Jeez. Poor kid. Head this big. Bobby. Who's Bobby? I know. Anything else down here? Oh, another one. The Emperor. The Emperor. Authority, paternity, structure designed to topple. No? How the mighty may fall and their empires with them. Let them bleed. Let them rip each other apart and let them rot. Uh, down here. No, down here. Yeah, there's quite a lot of stuff in this bit. Good job, I'm in charge of the controls, isn't it? What the hell was that? Oh, it's, these are the cells, aren't they? It's coming from a bed. Jacob. Ryan. Jesus, what happened to you? It's electrified. Hey, bad idea. Oh, shit. Look, you gotta get me out of here, man. How? Seriously. It's electrified. Okay, um, there's a box in the corner of the room. I think that's how they're operated, okay? I saw this old guy, under dude from the woods. He used that. Why are you here, Travis? You ought to be out with the others. Like I say, we've been all night long trying to keep those kids safe. Uh, She's the Hackett mom. It's Kaylee. She's dead. <laughs> no. The boys are bringing her in right now. Now I know you got a screw loose in that cop head of yours. There ain't no way to kill her in her kind of condition. Silver bullet. She's dead, Ma. No. No, no, not my granddaughter, not my only granddaughter, not my Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, you goddamn piece of shit, not my little Kaylee, God damn you, what did you do to her? Did you get bitten? 
Ain't she crazy? Wait! It's him! Think about it. Why would they lock him in a cage? And who the hell is it? Who the hell is she? She's in charge. You've already got it wrong once. It might even be Nick. Your friend? Hey, listen. Okay, they said that they've already got two of us accounted for. Whatever that means. Whoever this is, they're, they're not going anywhere. Remember? We've got to be sure. You promised. Fine. Fine. you got to get me out of here. Okay, seriously, man. <laughs> They took it! They took it! You fucking idiot! Ma. God damn it! You fucking piece of shit! Get away! Get away from me! Okay, okay, okay. Talk me through it. Okay, so all I know is you have to open my door and that door. And definitely not that door. Oh, cool. Thanks, Detective. Okay, fuck you, man. I'm trying to help. No, fuck you. I'm trying to help. Shut up! Shut up! Okay, there's a console on the wall over there, like a box or whatever. You should be able to use those switches to isolate each cage. Okay, hang tight. Okay. So he's cell three. Come on. <sighs> Isolate them, hang on. Oh, this could go really bad. I've literally, I've literally got no idea. Make a one. Okay, that seemed to be fine. Let's try number two. Ooh, okay. okay. Well done, not just the middle one, dude. Don't fuck this up. Well, he's cell three, isn't he? So what if I do... Oh, screw it, we're coming this far. I can do this, I can do this. Focus, dude, focus. He's cell three. Two open the middle one. Let's go two. And then he's cell three, isn't he? So let's just go three. Please be the one. You look awful. Thanks. Um, where's everyone else? Um, Jake. Emma wasn't with them. I don't know where she is. But you should go catch up with them. Be careful. We came into the mines. I don't. I don't know if there's a way back up. That's okay, Jacob. Not my, God, not, not my only granddaughter. You're still going on about that? Not my Kaylee. Not my little Kaylee. That's a damn mind. What? So, you, you had those motherfucking counselors in your goddamn jail for two whole motherfucking months, right? And you are telling me now that instead are putting a bullet into each one of their little sorry shit-stained brains? You, you gave them your silver bullet gun and they shot my Kaylee with it? Is that what you're telling me now, Travis? No more blood on your hands. That's what you, you, you said it. Oh, oh my God, we are way past that now. Oh, Ma, what, what if it had been me or, or, or Bobby? What then? She was your family. A good boy protects his family. You ain't no good boy. I wish I could take it all back. I wish I could take it all back, but I can't. 
Oh, I just don't, I, I don't understand why you, you, you couldn't have just taken care of the problem when you had the chance. Taking care of the problem? Do you hear yourself? Yes, I hear my goddamn self. I may be old, but I ain't deaf. I'm a police officer! Oh, so now I'm blind, you motherfucker! Now I'm blind. Oh, you just flashing that badge around like it's worth a million dollars. The only reason you got it is because Hank got killed in a gypsy fire! Ma. Don't ma! Don't ma me! Would you sit down, please? Don't you tell me what to do. Gypsy fire. Please. Don't you go around. Don't you go around like you better than everybody else, because you ain't! Would you please sit down? Don't you tell me what to do, you piece of shit this woman's got issues man yes gotcha. <laughs> Ryan run ma send Bobby down her beauty is a tiger. Be careful, make sure that she doesn't bite. Her beauty is inside her. That's why I need to find the key tonight. When I say yes, you say no. All this copyright music, mate. Stream emojis doesn't work. They're cool tunes, though. Which one do I want to see? Welcome I kind of want to see the mother one. Did you miss me? No. I mean, yes. Yes. Hopefully, you've brought me some more of my cards. Let's have a look, shall we? The Empress. Look at her. <laughs> Those at the top can fall the hardest. Such a shame to nurture little monsters only to live long enough to watch them kill you. <laughs> but it's no less than she deserves. The lovers. There's harmony and disagreement brought to light only by sparks of Blood flows from the heart. You can almost taste it. And tasting it could save someone's life. The Wheel of Fortune. After all, fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel. Sometimes you have to take a chance. Karma works in mysterious ways, but it favors those who pay attention. Watch closely. Though the wheel spins, the eagle-eyed can tell where it's going to stop. The lover's one, the, the blood from the heart the saves a life. It's where they put the blood on there. Authority, paternity, stricter. It's designed to topple, no? How the mighty may fall and their empires with them. Let them bleed. Let them rip each other apart. Let them rot. <laughs> Details. See more. Then choose the possible future you'd like to witness. And watch carefully. Lovers. I'll do lovers. Try and find See some clarity right. in the chaos. Lovers. Oh gosh, she eating his heart. Go, you still got time. Be careful now. Be very careful. Thanks. Have you been there before? The scrapyard? Nah, just seen the sign on my way to camp. What if we just, like, walk to the main road? This isn't the main road. 
No, this is all Hackett property. The main road is another mile that way. Wait, how do I know so much more about everything than you do? Wait, shut up. So basically, it's another hour walk to the main road, and then at least another three to four hour walk until we hit the nearest... whatever? Yeah. What was that? Let's just keep moving. Okay. So... I guess this is me now. What? You're gonna look great with a hook. We can call you... Hooky McHookface. Right. Yeah, I guess it's pretty... unique. I could get different attachments for it. <laughs> yeah, man. Lean into it. One hell of a story, too. Yeah, I guess it's something to talk about on the radio station. We're all gonna be laughing about this in a few years. You, me, maybe even Ryan. What do you mean by that? Kinda got close at the fire pit back there. Am I crazy or was something about to happen? This is always next year, right? Well, let's get through this year first. Wouldn't really matter anyway. It looks like we finally know Ryan's type. Confident and heroic with an eye patch. So pirates. Maybe she shivers his timbers. <laughs> there. Oh shit. Relax, it's motion sensor. We're okay, I think. Oh look, steampunk's back in. Ew, come on, this way. So what do we do now? Well, I guess we just make ourselves at home. Live up some cocktails, see what's on the TV. <laughs> no? Why are you always so positive? Oh, why do you keep asking me that? Uh, I asked you about your confidence, not your whatever is happening right now. Oh, I don't know. I guess I just don't like to see other people sad. Is that why you do the internet video thingy? Internet video thingy? Whatever it is you call it. You know, people think influencers do it just for the attention, and maybe you do at first. But after a while, it's like, What's the difference between 4,000 rando likes and 100,000 rando likes? But I make people laugh. <laughs> I act dumb and they laugh. Maybe that makes me dumb? Or maybe I just like to make people laugh. There's nothing wrong with that. Well, <sighs> fuck this nine, huh? Yeah. Come on, I wanna hear you say it. Fuck this night, fuck it all the way to morning. <laughs> Put me down! Easy, Ma. Put me down, you old witch! Blow your fucking head up! Everybody just relax. Can't shoot what you can't see, darling. Shoot you all with a spread. Gotcha. Don't tell me what you did to my Kaylee. Get the fuck off me. Shut up, redneck.
Everybody stop! Constance. What the fuck is going on up here? Uh, oh, wake up. Bro, wake she's up. gone. <laughs> Darling, wake up. She's gone. Little Bobby. Marlon's gone. Cuba. Yeah. No more party. No more protecting anyone. Travis. Casually just stuck a knife in him. Nice one, Bob Lloyd. Stop bleeding. Yeah, I'm not doing that. No. Oh, oh, oh. You'll bleed out if he does that, aren't he? Anything interesting up here? Oh, we got something over here. What's this? This is Bobby's room. Oh, Kaylee's letter. A confession addressed to her grandmother. Okay. Oh, there's an evidence collection. Good. I want to read it, though. Can I read it though? Evidence. I want to read it. Darn it. Never mind. I just wonder what it said. Isn't it? Oh, hello. Death. Oh, gosh. Here we go. Death. Death takes many forms. It could mean change, transition, transformation. Often interpreted as a beacon for the hopeful. In your case, it just means death. Oh, we got here. Come over, blew the mum's face off. Constance. I haven't got the door yet. Hang on. Whose room is this? Oh. It's a bit gruff, that. Cupboard. In the cabinet, bro.
How is he not hearing that? Yes. I'm close. Stand by. Over. Jog on, bobbers. You can't hide from me in my own house, fucker. You're a fucker. <laughs> Classic. You're a fucker. Right, so dad, daddy, daddy Lance Henriksen's after me. Just hide again. In the tub. Good choice. Nice, we got away with something. There are, there are bears around here? Uh, spores of the Hackett's hunting prowess. You'd think that they'd want to cover up bullet wounds and signs of injury. Perhaps they serve as a reminder that these animals are definitely dead. Look, hang on. We found out some more, didn't we, about this? Travis has used his power as sheriff to help his family cover their tracks ever since the fire six years ago. Bears around here? Bears beats Battlestar Galactica, you know. Oh, look. Don't play it, obviously. Just, you know, look at it. Why? 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 No, 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 no. Don't do that. It's a bit silly. Okay, upstairs it is. Has Lance Hemrickson got one of the best voices? Probably. Oh, hang on, what's this? Oh, hello, we got a tarot card. Excellent. Oh, there's a. Hang on, this way. Probably skips a load of stuff, of night. Uh, uh, howdy, darling. Howdy, darling. <laughs> We ain't playing games no more, little girl. Try me, motherfucker. You know something? I ain't got enough silver to kill you. But our sure to hell can make you suffer. Nice. 
Just run, Slampy. Miserable old man. off you know what she did to Kaylee and she killed your mother too See, because there's um, there's no blood trail, he can't find me. Well, he just keeps coming though, doesn't he? Catch the knife on that. Oh, it's not good. I won't tell anyone anything. No, man. Family first. Besides, I'll get in trouble. <laughs> Ow! You stabbed me! Yeah, fucking hurts, don't it? I ain't never been stabbed before. <laughs> Leave me alone. Ow, it really hurts. Dad! Go wrap that wound, mate. Oh, no, no, no. It's me. It's me. What the fuck happened to you? Oh, you know, nothing out of the ordinary. Oh, Ryan. Oh. How bad is it? I'm so sorry. Can we eat him? <sighs> that bad, huh? I keep trying to fix it. Whatever this is, people keep getting hurt. There's Max. How are you? It's not your fault. I didn't have to come here. I shouldn't have let you come. 
Uh, you're not the boss of me. <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. Am I dying? You've lost a lot of blood. But it'll, it'll heal though, right? Oh, if she bites him, she can save him. Wait. Maybe it... maybe it will. What? Ryan... If you let me... bite... you... What? If you let me bite you, it means you'll be infected. Which means... Which means it will heal. Yeah. But it also means... Yeah. Yeah, I got it, Big Bad Wolf. Yeah. <sighs> Ryan, I don't have much time. I can feel it like it's... fighting to get out. If you let me bite you and you heal, then... Then I have to kill Chris. It's, it's not killing Chris, it's killing a werewolf. It's saving your own life. And mine. And Max's and your friends, too. Let you bite me. And live to kill Chris Hackett. Or bleed out and die. Pretty much, yeah. It's your call, for now. So we doing this or no? Do it, go on. Do it. Okay. Path chosen. Ah. Be gentle. Nice and tender for you. You should start to feel better soon, I guess. guys never throw anything out, huh? So, do you want to give me some direction on what we're looking for specifically? Well, most of these cars look like they've already been stripped apart. It's just empty frames and chassis, which doesn't help us much. Okay, so we're looking for... engines? Well, anything relatively intact. Got it. Looks like we got our work cut out for us, huh? Try not to make too much noise. Oh, right. Sorry. Anything by you? Sorry. Not yet. Keep looking.
Cripes. You scare me, mate. Where now? Wait, is there something in here? Hmm, that's an I can use. Right here. Very good. Unsolved crimes. Unsolved mysteries and unsolved murders. I don't know what's wrong with me guys, neither the way. I drank lots of water today. Right, let's get this done. Hang on, there's a, there's there's upstairs here. Might be some stuff up there that's interesting. Maybe. What we got here? we got over hither? These sons of bitches had it all planned out. So what is it? So they know when the full moon is, all these people. Fact of the month. The average, con the average car contains over 30,000 unique parts. What have we got here? SUV, body damage. The scrawled request to keep something off the books is a little dodgy to say the least. There must be something here they don't want to know about. Keep this off the books and out the way. EDFF674. Who's T? Mm -hmm. Travis. Looks like these guys were cooking the books a little. <sighs> Dodgy. You said it. Oh, wait, is that... Oh, no, it's not. So which was Max and Laura's car, then? that's probably the one they're talking about, isn't it? Damaged SUV, keep it off the books and all that. Okay, there's nothing else here. All right, let's go. Go to this new, this new unlocked area. The hell, man. These lights are loud. Oh, what's this up here? Cheeky little shack. It's over here. Oh, hello. Judgment. Judgment. Judgment day is upon us. That's what you'd expect from this card, isn't it? Though perhaps in this case it's simpler than that. Perhaps one's own judgment, a snap decision to make, can save them from their very own personal day of reckoning. Every day, every step matters. Every decision tipping the balance one way or another. Sorry. Take your time. Think. And maybe survive. Whoa. Oh, hang on. Discarded signage. It's the from the uh, traveling um, freak show fire. That's it. The gypsy fire. The torn and broken remains of old sideshow attractions. The way they've intertwined with the rest of the scrap shows they've been sitting here for a long time. Hmm. What's this? Harem scare. See this, Caitlin? Interesting. Wait, what's up here? Look. It's Max and Laura's car. Is it Max and Laura's car? I think it might be. So, 
You ever operated a crane before? I actually used to be pretty, pretty good at the claw game at my local arcade. The kids used to call me the grabber. No, no, uh-uh. Uh-oh, I hear that now. Look, why don't you see if you can lower it down so I can take a look under the hood? Sure, yeah. Yeah, she's a good shot, isn't she? Um, so. Just uh, watch my back, yeah? Yeah. Looks like somebody's mom never taught them how to clean up after themselves. Okay, let's see what we're working with. All right, not too complicated. Welcome back, grabber. Now you're falling away, will you? What the hell is going on? My bad. All right. Here goes nothing. Come on, I dropped on her head. I think I found my calling. About time! <laughs> well, maybe we can see if we can try and get this thing running. <gasps> Score! Someone else here. Oh. Is she in the car? Excitement for one day, isn't it? Okay. Dylan, thank you. You actually saved my life. For realsies. Yeah, you know, no sweat. I just can't wait to see who they choose. What? To play me in the movie about how brave I am. Don't push it. So, so much for our brilliant escape plan. Okay, back to the lodge. Are you nuts? Better than being out in the open. Come on. Excellent. Well, that's uh, escalated quickly. 
wonder which one that was. What the heck? Hackett's Quarry Lodge Storm Shelter. Oh, back with Abby and Emma. We can't just sit here. Why not? Dylan said it's safe here. Well, yeah, I just... I don't want to be waiting around. But that's literally all we need to do. Just wait until morning, right? Fine. But we need protection. Go see what you can find. It's better than just sitting around. Okay. Um, okay. Oh, right. It's really dark down here. And we have no flashlight. Oh, great. There's the woman. Who's this woman? I know it's like, you know, Grace Brisky's character. I can't remember her name. Okay, well, I mean, there's nothing down there, but I, I don't want to miss anything. Ah, oh, here we are. Here are a front. My poor boy, do you see what they did to us? How they hurt us? He's still out there, all alone. Each full moon they hunt him armed with silver, trying to put an end to the a curse they inflicted on upon themselves when they set my show ablaze six years ago. Stupid children, but little Silas, my little white wolf, he must be protected. You must not follow this path. Do you understand? Remember how I've helped you all this time. So Silas is the white wolf. Then, I'm guessing. Hope it holds. Right, there's nothing down there. So... What have we got here? Oh, yes, good. Huh. Looks like the main fuse is gone. That's why there's no power? Why would somebody do that? What is it? Silver shells. How'd they get down here? The hunter must have dropped them. This is probably how he got upstairs and attacked Caitlin. These fucking guys are everywhere. Oh, look, something here. What'd you find? Oh, a ladder. Oh, I'm just checking out this ladder. Is that a tiny little door up there? Uh, yeah. We'll open it up. Why? We don't know it's up there. I do. Exactly. Oh, but it's got broken step. Have you been paying step. attention, like, at all? Okay, what I mean is, it might be good for us to have an escape route. You know, we don't know what's up there. It, it, the lodge, there there also could be a, a way for us to defend ourselves. Okay. Guess that makes sense. You can lock yourself in Chris Hackett's little, little room. But I've got to be careful because there's a step broken. You all right? Oh, well, yeah. Okay, yeah. that was that was close. Back is Laura. Quarter three. Oh, they ain't getting through there in a hurry. Man, this place is huge. I might need to rest a bit. You'll feel better soon. Cool. I'm feeling pretty good, actually. What are you doing? Stop it. 
Do you smell that? No. Never mind. Let's just find another way down. A way to Chris Hackett. Or just a way out, maybe. I'm done being chased and stabbed. Sure. And another way out. Fine. Huh. What's that? Pray we're on the right track. Stay close. Yeah, all the better to see you with, my dear. Shh. Hmm, I can't bloody see anything, mate. Let's check there's nothing over this side. What's over here? Is Chris living up here? Bet he is. <gasps> what was that? Chris Hackett. Son of a bitch. Flip it there. Family's got messed up. Back to normal? What? Oh. <laughs> you think this is over? This isn't over. What you mean? Uh, I don't understand Chris is dead. Oh. Oh, Chris wasn't the first. Silas. That's not possible. Caleb. Kaylee. The girl you killed? Her brother. What? 
Caleb bit Chris and Kaylee. Chris was just trying to protect him. He was a good man, my brother. Well, then who bit Caleb? Silas. Silas. We've been tracking him for years. He's a, a gypsy, a transient. He'd been long gone from the area, but we hoped he'd come back so we could end this. Anyway, there's sightings up and down the coast. A feral albino child, giant white wolf. White wolf? What? What'd you say? Where? Where'd you see it? Hey, let him go! At the cabins earlier tonight. Okay. Okay, it makes sense. It all makes sense. Uh, he must have been back for months, and he's what ran you off the road two months ago. Help me. Help me. We can still save Caleb. We can still save what's left of my family. We, we can help those who are still alive. Why the hell should I trust you? I'm not asking you to trust me. I'm telling you we can end this. We kill Silas, everyone gets better. Everyone, uh, who's still alive anyway. Okay, okay, so... Where would we even find him? I know exactly where to find him. Okay, let's go. This doesn't mean I forgive you for what you did to me. I understand. Can someone please get me some fucking clothes? Wow. You had your chance. You Oh, stop it. She's Silas's mum then. Gotta be. Gotta be Silas's mother. You had your chance. You had your chance to wipe out that wretched family and you failed. Hector Salamanca. Doesn't matter. There's still time. We can still come out on top. Past is the past. Let's just look to the future, shall we? Death. Death takes many forms. It could mean change, transition, transformation, often interpreted as a, a beacon for the hopeful. In your case, it means, well, it just means death. You're <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>, real funny. <laughs> What's your problem? Bitch. The sun, the vitality of a new day. There's still time to wake up to the warmth of a night survived. Your choices, your actions, your very life hangs in the balance. It's up to you to find your path in the darkness and see the sun rise once again. Judgment. The bells of judgment cry bloody murder. Or do they? The fury of a hatred earned. A fate deserved. Likely. But he may have his uses, though he won't forgive. He won't forget. The Hierophant. Where did you find this? Where did you find it? This shouldn't be here. He's been through enough pain. No, no, no. My poor boy. You see what they did to us? Oh, let me find out. Eliza, that's her name. 
Ooh, six years ago. No. <laughs> so Hank was killed in this fire. The old sheriff. What have they done? Silas the dog boy. I don't know. Silas, my boy. Oh, oh. Ah. That's the sheriff, but that's not Silas. Mommy's coming, Silas. Mommy's coming, Silas! 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 Ah, tower. How they hurt us. He's out there still, all alone. Each full moon they hunt him, armed with silver, trying to put an end to a curse they inflicted upon themselves when they set my show ablaze six years ago. Stupid children. Little Silas. My little white wolf. You must be protected. You must not follow this path. You're protected. Do you understand? Remember how I've helped you all this time? Shut up, I found the tarot cards, mate. Do what I want. Remember how much I've done for you. I'm gonna kill it. Or a max. your answer, pal. Asked an answer.
Likewise. Oh, think you nicked him. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Yeah, your taser, your bear spray, and your clothes, mate. It's all gone. Okay. Gotta find Laura. Yes, you win. <laughs> I swear no clothes. <laughs> Bro, you are rocking that. You are rocking those clothes. Hang on, which way? Oh, look, there's something there. Ah, that matches. Totally should have just gone to the Harbinger Motel. Yeah, and all this would have been avoided, wouldn't it? Wait, is this just down to the thing? Oh, there's nothing there. Oh, okay, let's um, push on. Sorry, mate, I just can't with what he's wearing. Yeah, music's been good, but it does honestly suck that it's all copyrighted, even though it's, it's turned the stream mode is turned on. Flipping neck, mate. This is a long part. Here we go. What's this? Cap. She must have come back. You like the water, mate. There's no boat. Do it. Okay. This better have a great fucking ending. Okay. I suppose Max like. The table, help me. Okay. Well, can't get much worse than it already is, right? Great. Just like the cartoons. It's been off and on all night. Gives us a little time. How do you figure? They don't like water, remember? Right, right. Oh, we should have just been swimming in the lake all night. And die of hypothermia? No. No. All right, well, we're good now. <laughs> Night's not over yet. These fuckers know we're in here. And they're coming back first chance they get. Great news. Okay. All right. We gotta get a vantage point. 
It's going to be like dog soldiers, where it's going to be like one last stand against these horrific... Are they lycanthropes? Anything decent up here? Nice to put a name to a big mean face. So what, you're like Mr. H's brother, I guess? Who? The big dude from earlier, when you and Ryan went to the radio hut. Mr. H's brother, I guess? Right, right. <laughs> so is uh, Bobby. Bobby Hackett. So he was in the military. High Priestess. Is this going to be, um... What's her face? Eliza was killed in the fire that broke out at a travelling show six years ago. Her ghost roams the woods of Hackett's quarry ever since. And she's determined to get revenge on the Hackett family for what they did to her. Her tarot cards once lost in the blaze have allowed her to guide you through the night. Oh, man, I'm tired. Through her motives, though her motives may not have been as transparent as first thought. Yeah, she wants me to kill the, the hackers, doesn't she? How long has this guy been here? Who is it? Large and overbearing. Oh, it's Septimus Hackett. The regal oil painting of Septimus Hackett holds, has, holds pride of place amongst the lodge's chimney column. The chimney column was mentioned in the blueprints. Long time ago. Long enough ago that it was okay to have an oil painting made of yourself. I kind of want an oil painting of me now. <laughs> Every dusk and dawn all through the summer. What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. stronger. We're here to lead the way. Fuck mates for life, we're proud to proud say. To shout at Strat and shout out loud. We're hacketeers. Two months and you never learn the words? You wanted to uh, light the fire. Showtime, motherfuckers. <sighs> Fuck this whole night. I just wish I could tell you I'm sorry. More than anything. <laughs> Wait, what time is it? In this game? Oh dear. Long game though, isn't it? Fuck. I just wanted one more night together. Is that too much to ask for? <laughs> Shit. Stop crying, you big baby. <gasps> That was a nice little scene. Thanks for that. What is going on out there? Should we go find the others? No, we're safer in here and it's nearly morning. What the? Wait. Okay, let's go. Let's go. 
Holy shit. Well, we gotta let her in. Well, we can't. The office door's locked from the outside. But there must be something we can well, do. Yeah, but what? Yeah, what can you do? Silver shells. If we can time it right, we can give them to her. She passes. If she passes. Oh, crap. Um. Beam. Don't panic. Oh, oh, oh. Nice. You mug. They might be the Wendigos until dawn, the last bit. Let's run. Caitlin, this way. the silver shells mate no go go you need the silver shells Late, you horrible thing. Fuck you. I got you, motherfucker. <laughs> oh, no. You got it? Yeah. Yeah, I got it. Nice little sharpshooter. What exactly happened six years ago? There was a fire that wiped out dozens of people, and now there's werewolves and a ghost that roams the woods looking for her lost baby boy. Which I've just put together is Silas. Oh, shit. It's a long story. No, it's not. There was a fire. Silas the wolf boy escaped, bit a bunch of your family. You failed to stop him. Burn. What happened in the past doesn't matter right now. Uh, it kind of does, actually. We need to know what we're up against, at least. What we're up against is a feral boy turned werewolf for the last six years has avoided being found. No matter what we did, 
Every full moon we were out there looking. Every single one. Now the son of a bitch is finally here. So what we're up against is my only chance to end this thing for good. So how do you even know where he is? How the hell are we gonna find him just driving down the middle of the road? <laughs> chance i've Where seen the have... i've seen this film before he have just disappeared he's got to be nearby let's look around are you crazy yeah where's, where's ryan oh there he is are we there yet you're okay. Been better, but yeah. Over here. Got some blood. Leads through there. What the hell happened back here? Whoa. This is where we went off the road two months ago. You're trying to decide if you should shoot me in the head right now. Go ahead. If that's what you want, I won't stop you. What? Normally, I'd have werewolf's blood cover our scent, but I'm all out, so we're high risk. We could be killed. You ready to end this? Let's fucking do this. Go team! Go team! has got some uncool vibes. Podcast didn't do it justice. You don't know the half of it. This is where I saw her. Her? I thought she was... I thought Max hit her, but then I was out here and she was something else. Who? The woman. The old woman. She was saying something over and over again. Oh my god, she was saying Silas. No, that's impossible who you're talking about. I saw her too. In the run tunnels. It's Eliza Vorez. Silas's mother. I think. Who was she? She ran a traveling sideshow called Harem Scarum. Came here six years back. She kept her son in a cage. Called him Silas the Wolf Boy. Died in a fire. Some say she never left. 
The hack of Hackett's quarry. We've been looking for Silas ever since. How did the fire start? Really? You're still hiding stuff now? You blew half the head off my niece, Kaylee Hackett. One of the kindest, gentlest souls to ever walk this earth. And all she wanted to do was help that little boy. Locked in a cage by that freak show witch. What did she do? She just wanted to help him. Travis. She convinced Caleb to start a fire. It was just a distraction. It's May Bales. Give him enough time to get Silas out of his cage and give him his freedom. That's not what happened. No. Because within minutes, everybody was dead. Never see Hayburn, Liza, whole crew. Kaylee managed to get Silas to freedom. But Caleb got bit in the process. That's why you've been hunting him. Silas, I mean. Every full moon for six fucking years. Some commitment. Some hunter you are. This, this is all that's left. Jesus Christ. Man. Any sign? Negative. Damn, I never saw any of this. I didn't even know this was here. We must be close. Did you both see, see it too? Kind of wish I hadn't. Sam. What is it? Silas, the dog boy. That must be it. Careful. Oh, look at these flashing leaves, mate. raise gun no shoot him Laura do it he's just a boy Laura! he's responsible for so much death says you do it no give me the gun oh man I didn't I uh oh, I saw what, what's happening I should have killed you when I had the chance.
Those leaves are annoying me, man. I bet you think you have it all figured out. I bet you think you're fucking clever. I tried to help you. I tried to warn you. I even started to like you. Not now. Not after this. I will not forget what you made them do to my Silas. I've been with you all night. And I'm not about to stop now just because the night's come to an end. No. Whenever you hear a noise in the dark, a whisper from the shadows, the breath on the back of your neck, that's gonna be me. I'll be there. <gasps> now I will never leave you. I'll never leave you. Come follow me. To a place where the fear is gone and the worries fade away Cause it's a brand new day I've got you and you've got me The sun is bright and the air is free So let's go, oh, throw the map out the window oh, oh, oh. You've got me and I've got you That's all we need cause all we're gonna do is be young Don't you know I'm the one you wished for? Oh, that was rough. <laughs> It sucks that Max's fate hinged on one decision. Have we got enough evidence to clear our names? That's the question, isn't it? Bodies recovered in summer camp murder mystery. What do you make that, Anton? Bad journalism? Murder mystery? Isn't that just an unsolved murder? Um, being jostled. Oh, come on, get on with uh, it. In uneven uh, row of cobblestones. This podcast stuff's been going on for about seven on. minutes. Something so I'm going to leave this video there because they're just going to keep going on and on and on. Um, but that is it for this game. I hope you did enjoy. I hope you did enjoy my choices. Um, I think some people died. So, um, But yes, anyway, um, I need to play this again anyway. Uh, that's why I blitzed through this game. Uh, because I do need to crack on and get the footage for the story explain video. Um, but yes, if you did enjoy this playthrough, please leave a like on it. And subscribe to the channel if you're not already. And leave a comment down below on what you thought about this game. But for now, take care, and I'll see you in the next one.